Hello, Tracy here, Sweet Spot E Magazine. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize I looked this rough until I started the camera, but oh well. So, um, <clears throat> thank you so very much for the likes, the subscribes, the views, the shares, the comments. Please subscribe. I am trying to reach my goal of 2000. Um, I would like to send a special, <clears throat> excuse me, shout out to Randy. Hey, Randy. Um, so now the download that I got is like, um, somebody is, somebody is, they're going to make a bold move. They, they have it up in their mind. The next time they see you, they're going to make a bold move. They're going to tell you exactly how they feel. It's a positive thing. They're going to let you know, you know, everything that they didn't tell you before. <clears throat> Bottom of the deck, we have woman holding a coin. This could be someone who owns a business. This could be someone who's well off. This is someone who understands their worth. Um, this is someone who um, is you know, has some nice things, you know, maybe a generous person, or, but this is somebody I feel that, that has some money for sure. What is the message spirit? Thank you. Archangel Metatron. That's that third eye chakra. <clears throat> I feel like um, this person's third eye was opened since the last time you've seen that person. Since, since the last time you've seen that person, this person has had an awakening. Yes, because they went through a major life transformation. They suffered greatly. It's like their entire world was turned upside down and they had no choice but to go within and to pray and to ask God to beg God to show this person the way What else, Spirit? Is this person, they, they want to wear their heart on their sleeve. They want to tell you everything. <clears throat> they want to tell you that maybe before they kind of felt jealous. Maybe before they felt a little envious or whatever. But now it's totally different. They see everything completely different. Especially about you. It's almost like everything that you told them came true. Everything that you talked about happened. It's almost like <clears throat> after that happened, that's whenever they realized after you'd gone what and who they lost while they went through this total life transformation the one person that they always wanted to be there was you it's like you knew the exact thing to calm their nerves you knew the exact thing to help them to balance them out to get them on their path. But you weren't there. It's like they struggled with a decision. Should they call? Should they not call? Should they call? Should they not call? And they just prayed that one day you'd reach out. And they said that if you ever reached out, 
that they were going to take that opportunity. And that day came. Someone reached out. And someone else took that opportunity. Bottom of the deck. Judgment. I'm telling you. Someone went through such a life transformation that... They feel like if no one else ever has to go through what they went through, that person will be blessed. That they see everything totally different now. Especially since their third eye is open because yours was open. Yours was already open. They couldn't see what you could see, but they can see it now. They went through that awakening. Life is totally different for them now. They're so happy. They're so free. <clears throat> it's like, you know, maybe they... Uh, are moving forward rapidly. They're creating the life that they can tr truly wanted. I mean, it's going in a completely fast pace, and they're even shocked and dismayed. Unsure how it's happening. Because they really didn't have the confidence before. It's almost like somebody before, somebody that they were connected to, <clears throat> would tell them, oh, you can't do this. This is outside of your league. You you don't have the skills. You can't take control. But that's not the truth. This person is totally taking control. We have the Empress the Five of Cups, the Eight of Cups, and the Knight of Pentacles. This is how this person views you, the Empress. It's like this this person so sad, thinking about when you walked away. And apparently you walked away and it's been some time. It's been some years. And it's like, because you brought a happiness to this person whenever you were around. Like, you helped this person to be able to see things in a totally different light. And now that... This person, it, it's almost like this This person is in communication again. <clears throat> this person wants to say things. This person wants to, to talk about things. This person wants to make something official, make something solid, make something real. It's like, it's going to feel overwhelming because it's like this person's going to come in fast. But it's almost like they know what they want. They know what they want. It's like they they want you to come out from the cold or for them to be able to come out from the cold and both of you to be able to work on this. To work on moving this this relationship forward or even this could even be about a business. Move this business forward. Because maybe this person understands that you have skills that they don't have or that you can do things that they are not able to do. It's like this person, I feel like they they got something that they're holding to their chest right now. But they want to do, it's like I feel like this, they want to make some type of possible contract.
because they know what they know or something. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, they definitely want to move something forward. Chariot. Could have to do with cars. Could have to do with cars. But whatever it is, it's uh, this person has been thinking about this. This person has been praying for this. And they are so happy. It's almost like they feel like they finally found what they were looking for. They're finally getting exactly what they're looking for. And they intend to go for it. Let's talk about that sun. Let's talk about the sun. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. About the decision. What about that decision? What about that decision? Thank you, Spirit. Oh, okay. Maybe a decision uh, from, of instead of you being single with the Nine of Pentacles, maybe working together. You know, maybe that's a, it's an offer that's saying, hey, someone's saying, I want you to work with me. I don't want you to remain single. I want us to, to make money together, to do this together, to, you know. It's almost like this is something that somebody's been holding in for a while that they've possibly wanted to work with you for a while. It's like it's almost like this person sees making money with you. They feel stability with you. This is a lot of money. <clears throat> this is a lot of money. What else, spirit? What else? Thank you. Oh, oh. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What else? I'm telling you. More money. They want to work on this partnership. They want to work on this business. They want you to work on this business with them. They want you to to, <clears throat> to do something, to, to make a decision to, hey, we can do this together. Because they know you have great communication skills they know that you have an eye for detail they know that you are not one to play and they know that you are about your mother trucking business they also know that you are extremely intuitive extremely intuitive and you see everything and everyone clearly and that you are going to tell the truth about everything and everyone. But the best part is you can read people. You can see people's souls. That's the best part. And that's what's missing from their business. Because they know they got some shady people working there. And they want that to stop. So who are they wanting to come in to do business with? Someone that they know knows how to get down to wear and maintain that motherfucking crown. Okay. Yeah, it looks like somebody wants wants this Queen of Swords to yeah, I, I come on, let's do this. Let's I need you to have my back. Because they know that you will have their back. You, because I know that you had their back. Oh, 
bottom of the deck. We got the King of Pentacles. I'm telling you, it's this, it's this business owner. <clears throat> it's this business owner. This business owner is like, wait a minute. Please, I, I need you on my team. I need you on my team because you know what? This person is a very caring and kind and giving person, but she knows she's already being taken advantage of. She knows. I'm telling you, this could be dealing with the car business. You know? It could be dealing with a car business. What else, Spirit? Thank you, Spirit. And I feel like, you know, maybe someone has questions. You know, but and, and and wondering, well, why me? But it's something about you, and it's something about you that has this person obsessed, feeling like you would be the per perfect one, because you come with that truth, you come with that honesty, and you're not afraid to tell people whatever it is that they need to hear. You don't back down. You do not back down. I'm telling you. That person knows you about business. You are about business. What else, Spirit? What else? Thank you. Yep, it's like um, clarifying the uh, that uh, heart, heart, the broken heart and the storm. You know what this person went through that totally changed their life. It's like you know it took them a while to really come up out of that, and they're really just now coming out of that. And they and and once you walked away, they felt completely out in the cold. And they've been there since. So it's like now they feel like they have another opportunity. They want to talk to you. They want to communicate with you. They want to make you an offer. They want to let you know exactly how they feel. And that's, I'm telling you, they're coming with that communication of truth. They're coming saying, hey, I'm not I'm not I'm not about any confusion or anything like that. I'm about peace. This person this person wants you to gain control of to help her gain or yeah, her or him gain control of whatever they got going on. What else, spirit? What else? What else? Thank you. So let me see. Whenever it hit, it hit upside down because it turned like this. So right now, they do need some help. I'm telling you, this might be like a car business or something because here's the chariot again. Because they, they understand that people are, they do need some help because they understand that people are, are not being honest. I feel like somebody's trying to steal from them. Yep. Someone is trying to steal from them. And I feel like there's been communications that have been had before, but, but she ca hasn't been able to really catch them. So she's going to bring in the equalizer. Who's about to equalize the shit out of that? Yep. And make it so that she can get, leave this, you know, get away from this person that's causing her, you know. Because this person is just bringing toxic energy. This person is just bringing her and everything else down. Because once she's able to leave that, then here she is. Right on top. And that's exactly what she wants. That's exactly 
what she wants. Yes, yeah, spirit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and pull some from the stack. Oh, not this man. <clears throat> thank you. Yeah, I feel like somebody, they are so... It's like they're, they're so happy to reconnect again because they are about to make you a a nice business offer. They they know you are about your business. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Thank you. Anything else? Okay. Anything else? Hold on. <laughs> Okay. All right, that's good. It's like something something about your vision. Something about your vision. It's like you have good vision. You you can see things. <clears throat> and she is convinced. This person is convinced. What does that say? What does that say? A new opportunity soon. Yep. A new opportunity soon. Yep. Somebody is do they they trying to do like a karma uh uh karma exchange with this person. But it's about to fail. Somebody's about to lose their job. I told you this was about a business. She's been having this person has been having nightmares. Look. Yep. And nightmares and messages about money. That's how she knows that she is so happy to reconnect because this person who's who they're reconnecting, reconnecting with that that uh, high priestess. Something about this person's uh, third house. Ooh, uh, relatives, technology, communication, creativity, siblings. Something about someone's third house. Yep, yep, yep. Someone is uh, spiritually unprotected. And and maybe that's what she needs, is some spiritual protection. But right now, someone else is spiritually unprotected. And, but somebody who's about to lose their job, it's like they're trying to rally the troops around to go to go against somebody. Because they are, are, are obsessed with, you know... Obsessed with, you know, this business owner. Yep. So I'm telling you, somebody's getting ready to come back. They want to come back. They want to make an offer. Yes, yes, yes. They want to make an offer. And the reason that they want to make an offer is because what they love about you most, especially when it comes down to business, is they feel you are a dictator at it. They know. You know exactly what to say with your third house and your communication skills. Okay? You know. All right. I'm going to leave it right there. Please subscribe. See you next time. Thank you so very much.